I need y'all to quit saying that single mothers aren't accountable because accountability looks like raising your child, even if that means you got to do it by yourself. And sometimes you cry yourself to sleep because you ain't got no mother help. Nobody want to babysit this kid. So half the time you don't have a social life. You struggle because you got to pick between whether I get my nails done or whether my kid gets to go to football practice today. That's what accountability looks like. Somehow I'm going to stretch this dollar I got and make it into eggs, milk, make it into covers. I don't know how I got to work 48 hours in two days, but I'm going to make it to a PTA meeting. I'm going to call in, make sure his homework is done. That's what accountability looks like. So quote, that single mothers are not being accountable for their actions. Accountability means you take care of your responsibility no matter how the f they got here. What y'all need to do is start talking to these deadbeat ass n about accountability. Cause y'all seem to protect them far more than you protect single moms. I need- Shalom, my people. I am Sigma Male Wolf and this is Who's Out of Order. No, who's out of order? What I do is I react to videos and news stories. Then I tell you who I think is out of order. And I've also got a special guest, Mr. J. What's up, man? What's up, bro? Nothing, nothing. <laughs> oh, what do you think about that? Stop saying single mothers aren't accountable. Yeah, it's yeah, that's true. You know, I, I was raised by a single mom, so I had a stepdad, but. With my dad, so uh, it's a little pressure, a little touchy for me. <laughs> okay, so I mean, you know, I mean, what, what what do you mean by? I mean, okay, when he said a choice between getting your nails done for the child or buying the child something, I forgot what he said. Yeah, I mean, I'll let the child play football. It's my favorite. Yeah, let him play football. How is that a hard choice? It shouldn't be. It shouldn't be a okay. choice at all. It should be a okay. Uh, okay. I mean, I, I don't even understand. You know. <clears throat> what? I mean, you, you wouldn't understand. <laughs> well, explain it to me. Then. I can tell me I, out. My mother was single mom, and she made sure I had. She took care of me for years without my right. dad even helping out at all. For years without him helping out, she did. She took care of me. Right. So, do, but do you think she took accountability? Oh, you froze. You, f man, I'm losing. I lost you. I'm here. You still hear me? Can okay. Hear me? Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, All she right. took, definitely took accountability. Yes. Yes. Okay. Well, I think this gender a little bit different. Yeah, they different. Yes. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, because they want to, they want to drop it. The, they want to drop Woo. their kids off at, at grandma yeah, house, yeah, yeah, yeah. so they can go party. They, yeah. you, when you see them walking with their kids, their kids look like they, they, they got bummy clothes on, but mom, mom dressed nice. Yeah, yeah. She got her weave. She got her. Yeah, that's not huh? That's, that's yeah. Not she got her weave. She got her nails done. She, she got her on her war paint. Yeah, but you know, I bet a lot of time she didn't pay for that. Some dude did. Which is, which might be. I mean, is it some dude or her? Her dude, dude. The, the child's father. Dude. Probably not the father. <laughs> not the kid's bummy. <laughs> not the kid's bummy. It's not the dad. That's not the daddy for real. Right. It's some other name. Is it? But here's dude? here's my thing. She probably got some oh. dude paying for her nails. Another dude paying for her hair. You know what I'm saying? You know how they do. Yeah, yeah. Well, here's my thing. Uh, a single mother with one child by one baby daddy. Um, I I feel for that more. But a single mother with five kids, four kids, with three different baby daddies, uh, I can't feel that. Yeah, I can't tell you. So is he saying that I should stop telling her to take accountability or what? And then he started talking about niggas. Well, she chose those dead Pete niggas. Yes, 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 she did. That's but you know, what she chose say, to be with. Huh? They always say, he wasn't like that when I met him. Come on, man. Come on, <laughs> know, man. Right? There was red flags. There's always red flags. Always red flags. Always. 
that's just what she was attracted to. She just don't want to say that's what she attracted yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, that's all. That's you, all yeah. you opened your legs and let this man go on you raw, yep. knowing yep. that he wasn't knowing. shit. Knowing. Knowing he wasn't shit. And see, here's the thing. A lot of women think they can change a man. They think they can change him. Yeah, yeah, they do. You know, they really do. He they might, do. she might know he a player. She might know he out here mess with all these different chicks, but she thinks that she's the one. A lot of women just want that dude to come home, to come home to them. Especially if he's um, popular out here in the trees, you know, well-known type of guy. She doesn't want him to come home to her, man. That's well, all she, he no, she, oh, well, yeah, but she, she want the other women to know that he come home to her. Yes, they do. They do want that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? That's why they post up pictures. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But the thing is, is basically, I can't feel for you if you got three baby daddies and yeah. you know, and it's hard and to. Five it's kids. hard. You gotta it's be. Hard. You gotta be exceptional. That's all I gotta say. In order for me to go be down with someone like that, you had to be exceptional. How can you? Uh, yeah. Okay. Exception, fucking no, bro. For real. Only way I can do that. So you may okay. What you mean? I guess, man. My thing is, is you can just gotta watch who you spread your legs to. Yes, that's definitely the case. And letting him lay his seed in you. Yeah. Cause they don't want to take okay, accountability okay, for that. Okay. We'll play devil's advocate. Well, if they had it kind of more, the motherfucker busted. What how often does that happen? But it happens. Yeah. That would last. Hey, never mind. <laughs> I'm about to get some personal shit, but never mind. But yeah, that's what, that's what they say. That's what they say. That's what they say. That what they say happens. Oh, I busted. I, 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 you know, I always say, we know when the motherfucker bust. We can feel it. We know when it bust. Mm -hmm. She Just knows too. Going. I don't know if they feel it though. I guess they know. They know. Do they? I mean, come on, man. It feels different. That's why they want it raw in the first place. If it didn't, if it didn't feel no different, they'd be like, "Oh yeah, that's true." Well, yeah, yeah, Put on the yeah, 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 right there. You know but I'm mean? saying, in the heat of the moment, when they, you know, they about to buzz, they probably like, they don't give a fuck. <laughs> they yeah, just all right. Feel it. Okay, so let's say they get to that point where they don't give a fuck, right? That's why right. they got too many kids, but too many different daddies, yeah. But my thing is, is still take accountability for it. Oh, yeah, they got to take accountability, yeah. There's very few women who would take accountability for that shit with all that many kids. Right. Very right. few, very few. Right. So I don't know how many kids he was talking about. I don't know if he was talking about just one, a, a woman with one kid or something like that. I understand that. I understand that mistake. Yeah, yeah. But when you keep making that mistake over and over, it's no longer a mistake. It's a right. choice. So you said I was going to take my leg? have to take some <laughs> accountability what you say so you said i was a mistake by the lake because only one of me <laughs> a mistake by the lake yeah you only say that but that's, that's an old saying oh okay no <laughs> yeah but your parents were married oh yeah they did get married yeah they, got married. Yeah, they were married man so you know that's a whole and that's a whole nother story yeah it is yeah, it is you know what i'm saying that ain't even in the same category your parents were married, but these yeah. a lot of these women are no, they're not, they're not having married, kids yeah. without being married. Yeah, yeah. With the wrong dude. Yeah, they, they are. They definitely are. And they know they're the wrong dude when they when they lay down with them. They know this. They, you can't tell me he changed. <laughs> <laughs> he just like, all you know, of a sudden. I, and you know another one I've heard. Well, what? Like, like okay, like these dudes they be sleeping with. They be having three or four other kids too, and they be like, "I didn't know. How the fuck Come you on, not how do you not know this? Check on this nigga. Yeah, you laying up with this dude. I don't understand that. You letting this dude go up and you raw and you ain't did raw. a background you, check. Yeah, you ain't did none of that. I know. You don't know nothing about him. No, he already got three, four kids. You now you about to make his his, his fifth one, and then you're yep. gonna be crying about he he a deadbeat. And he yep. ain't paying child support. Well, exactly. of course That's he's not exactly paying child support. Do. 
that's exactly what the fuck. How's he gonna? Bro? How is he gonna be paying child support and he had already uh, got with four other chicks like you? They always say they didn't know. This is what I always heard. I didn't know he had these other kids. To fuck yeah. That man. Yeah. I mean, he may be able to hide it in the beginning. He may, yeah. I, I'll give it to him. He may be able to hide it in the beginning. There's always red flags. You just ignore them. Yeah. I mean, it was a red flag. When, come on, man. Come on. A lot of, like, like we know a lot of dudes, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, out of the dudes you know, you know who, who the good dudes are with the, yeah, yeah. With, with the women yeah. and who are yeah. not. Yeah, yeah, I do. You know that. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? You can just tell by even how they approach approach women. Yeah, yeah. And how they talk to them and everything. Oh, they're going to tell them everything they want to hear in the beginning. Yeah. And that's all they want is is for a man yeah. to tell them what they want yeah. to hear. Yeah, yeah. You they know what I mean? That's what they be wanting. That's why they be going set up for these lames. They want yes, man. Yeah. Or, or these grimy dudes that, that got four or five kids already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> That'd be Come so on. fucked up, too. That'd be so messed up, man. Yeah. Yeah. What else he's saying here, man? Uh, make, you know, making sure the kids' homework done and all, all that stuff and not dropping them off. I mean, I mean, that's parenting. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's what all parents do. I don't know. I don't know what he was so upset about. But a lot of kids want to get dropped off somewhere else. Shit. They don't want to stay at home. Yeah, but a lot of what he said, though, I think he said that some people don't want to keep the kids. Yeah, they want to keep their own kids. Yeah. Yeah. You, you made them, you keep them. Fuck that. Right, right. You know? Like I didn't, I didn't, I, you know, I got four kids, man. We weren't going dropping my kids off nah, yeah, on, yeah, on the yeah. weekend, for no reason, <laughs> over to right. my parents' house. Right, we wasn't right, doing right. that. Nah, y'all wouldn't do it, that. That's not their responsibility. Not it's all. mine. Yep. <laughs> and and there's been plenty of times, plenty of times. Like I, the the, the part where he said the nails are football or whatever. Nah, man, you know what? There's been plenty of times by buy them some some shoes or i get some shoes right and guess oh, what hell yeah hell yeah they got you know what i'm saying and if they, they really it. need shoes i'll get them the shoes right yeah basketball when they were playing basketball and everything travel basketball you don't think you know what i'm saying you, yeah. you got to oh, make I those know. sacrifices i know that's Leave that's a there. part of parenting so yeah. you, you probably should have thought about that when you spread your legs the first time yeah yeah <laughs> Yeah, that was yeah. fun. You had four of them. One. Damn. Woo. Yeah. Uh. Four. So I know about sacrifice. Yeah, yeah, you do. So, you definitely do. so I Very think funny. I got triggered off of the nails or football. Yeah, huh? yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you talking about? <laughs> yeah. You brought this child into this world. It's no longer about you. Yeah, it's not about you it's for always 18 been about, years. It's always been about them. It's always been about them. But here's the thing, man. It's not once you have a kid, it's not about you anymore. No, it's not. It's not. But it's mostly about them. But that's what they need to recognize, and he needs to recognize that too. Yeah, yeah. It's not about you. It's about the kids. You gotta at yeah. least raise that kid up until it's 18. Yeah. In my case, in my and case, how I was many raising... kids? How many kids actually leave home when they're eighteen anyway? Most of us don't. But still, what I'm saying is, is basically that you have you you made the child. Yeah. The child comes first, right. above all all that stuff. The child comes first. Mm -hmm. I had to do that for altogether twenty eight years. Yeah, yeah, I know. You see what I'm saying? When other people wanted to go out and party and stuff like that, no. Yeah. Kids yeah. come first. Kids change their whole life. They really do. Yeah. 
They changed their whole life. Yeah. So, you know, I don't know. I don't know. You know? Yeah, you got to buy eggs. You got to buy milk. You got to buy all that stuff. Yeah. You, you got to buy shit, food. Yeah. You got to keep the lights on. Yes. That's yeah. adulting. That's parenting. You yeah, got to keep yeah. the lights on. You got to keep a roof over their head. You know, like people that, that be talking about stuff, they like, I can't relate to that. <laughs> what? No, like, my cousins, you know, they, they like might get cut off of her friends. I can my, my mother said that shit happened to me, happened to us one time. She said, I was so young, I don't remember. And she said, it would never happen again. And that's never happened again. Right. One time. And I was too young to remember. Here's my thing. Unless you were married and got divorced. Right. Or something like that, or or the father died, mm-hmm. or something like that. Choose these men more wisely. Yes, they should. They definitely should. <laughs> they definitely should. Don't be having kids with the, a dude you really don't know. Yeah, yeah. And then you don't have to walk around saying somebody's a deadbeat. Damn, yeah, home with that one, I'm like Damn. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're right. I don't, I don't listen to that deadbeat shit. And and spe- especially if he already had kids, so you know your kid gonna get a piece of the pie, depending yeah, yeah. on how how many how kids big, he got. Yeah, how big the pie is. Yeah. But like I said, he always say they didn't know. Okay. To my experience, dealing with women like that, they didn't. No, that's what they say. They 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 knew they were spreading their legs. Yeah, they, they definitely knew that. They definitely did that. And they always say they wasn't like that in the beginning. Come they on. They always some red flags. Always. Always. Come on. They, they just choose to ignore them. Come on. All they right. Here's a red flag, flag, ladies. If you meet a man and in the beginning. He said everything that you want to hear. Red flag. Yep. <laughs> yep. I'm going to make it easy for you. Red yep. flag. Cuz here here's here's how he says everything you want to hear. Cuz y'all talk too much. Mm-hmm. Now women always say that we never listen to them. But yeah. the only way we can get with you is to listen to you. Yes, yeah. That's the only way we we are we are great at listening to y'all. But here's the thing, y'all be telling us everything we need to know. When we first meet you, yeah, you they do. They start do. talking about they your do. ex and all the stuff he was doing and everything like that. And all this dude is sitting back going, "Hmm, okay, all right, I'm just uh, all right. Uh, let me watch myself on that. Yeah, okay. Yep. Oh, <laughs> yeah." Okay. All right. Yeah. Thank you for the information. That's all he doing. Yep. That's all mm-hmm. he doing. Now, now, a dude that that when you first when you first start talking to him, and these are the these are the dudes they throw away though. Sometimes, uh, a dude that uh, she may not he ain't telling her what she want to hear, and everything like you that. Tell the truth for the real. Yeah. 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 If he keep it real with her. Or something like that. She don't like that. But that's probably the dude you probably need to be. Yeah, they'd be they'd be more compatible with dudes like that. Yes. Yeah. 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 Because he's not. I hate that shit all the goddamn time. Yeah. Because he's not saying <laughs> what. And and you already you already know me. So. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> definitely. Yeah. <laughs> you already special, know me. I just say special motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> you already know. I ain't gonna tell you what you want to hear. Nah, I, tell you, I tell you what it is. You know what I mean? And then you just decide from there. Have you ever, though, did that to get some coochie? No. I mean, I even when we were in high school? I've been the same way. Okay. The same way, always. And, and, and now you know me from high school. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Even in high school? Yeah, you know me from high school. And... Me being the way I am now, I still was getting on. Yeah, you was like a motherfucker. Yeah. So, so 
it's just a lot of times you just got to tell them exactly where you stand. Yeah. yeah. And then they'll 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 either they'll either uh go with it or not. Or not, right. Yeah, right? Yeah. yeah and yeah. and you've known me all these years. I don't really have issues where a woman, you know, talk crazy about me. No, you don't. You really don't. You really don't. Cuz I just keep it real the whole time. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. You really know. Yeah. Now sometimes they don't want to hear it. Hear the real. You but know. You locked down for a lot of years too. I'm talking like, about before that. Oh, before that, yeah. I'm talking yeah, about yeah. before that. Yeah. Really, I'm saying nothing really too bad about you. No, I can't remember that ever. Yeah. When have I had some major issues? I remember nothing, bro. Uh. Yeah. And then all all my kids is by one woman. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's a beautiful thing. That's a beautiful thing, uh, bro. But, but <laughs> I, I mentally, um, said that when I was young. I'm not having kids with a bunch of different women. I'm not. Yeah, I did. I said that too. I said that too. Yeah, I'm not gonna. And do I, it. I, I did say I was gonna marry the woman. I had my kids with kids, but I did say that. I did. Yeah. Yeah, man. So. All right, people. Y'all let us know what y'all think. Stop. Single mothers aren't accountable. Let us know in the comments. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And let us know what you think. Well, what you got to say, man? Peace. <laughs> Peace. Be one. <laughs>